morning everyone just um it's day oh god what day are we on 17 i haven't uploaded 15 and 16 yet because i haven't done it it will probably go up tonight but you guys won't even know that well you will if you're waiting for it um i can't believe it's day 17 of vlogmas it's just it's gone by so quickly um i just thought i'd get ready while i talk to you I've got the Glow Recipe Pineapple Bright Serum, which I'm really enjoying. A lot of people don't like the smell. I think I can smell pineapple juice, but Claire smells cheese. So there's something in it, I think. So I'm just popping that on um, just as I get ready for work. I'm so, so tired. Um, I woke up this morning at about five o'clock, went to the loo, as you do, and then stayed on my phone till about six which is when my alarm went off and went back to sleep so um did well there but um i'm just exhausted i had a really busy day yesterday i've got a really busy day today but yeah i just i feel so tired but hopefully by the end of today i won't feel so bad so today i've got work as usual I'm in the office I worked from home yesterday so I'm in the office today I'm glad to go back to be honest because when I'm at home I love being at home because I can concentrate but Rupert is really distracting like he'll bark if I'm on a conference call or something like that so that's the bit that gets rather annoying my number one skin care product for this year I think has got to be this this is the body shop oils of life intensely revitalizing sleeping cream and i put on um about a five pea sized amount and then i put that on my neck and my face and when i wake up in the morning my face feels like so happy and smooth um i haven't used it for the last few nights because i haven't worn makeup it's usually my like take my makeup routine uh, take off my makeup routine and I'm gutted because actually I need to. <laughs> So today's outfit of the day is this Matalan Papaya Curve blouse. It's got elasticated sleeves at the bottom, um, so it's sort of like a puffball sleeve, just slightly. It's a ditzy print with these tie bits at the, the like tassels. I think I've shown you them before there. Um, and then I've got my uh, midi skirt on that I absolutely love from ASOS. So that is today's outfit of the day so i am back um back home oh you can hear me put drinking while i'm waiting for claire i wanted to do a bit of a um 
haul actually for you, which I don't do often. Um, I wanted to show you what I bought from my friend and also um, I also won a little goodie bag as well. So I wanted to show you what I got from the body shop. So my friend Jess, who I used to go to school with, she watches Vlogmas all the time. So hi Jess. Um, she is a body shop at home consultant. I know quite a few, but I trust Jess. And that's weird to say, actually. I think it's just that we went to school together. We've been through a lot together, actually. And she knows my taste better than most people. And we've always been quite friendly and very friendly, obviously, do like, school. But we're online friends a lot more now because we both live in very different areas. So I thought I would show you the things that I bought and the things that I didn't buy. <laughs> so... The reason I want to quickly talk about this actually is because earlier I was talking about the Body Shop Oils for Life Cream and it's like my number one go-to and I got it from Jess. Um, in fact, she has got a Facebook page. I'll link you to her because she's always doing offers and she's really, really great at little um, prizes and stuff like that. So I'll link to her Facebook group down below. So go and join that or let me know in the comments if you want to be added but I will pop it in there, if that makes sense. Anyway, so I'll show you the things that I bought. So the first thing I wanna talk about um, is the eye colour stick, this. Right, I thought, I've not seen these before, and I thought this looks, oh, it's falling out, doesn't matter, it's fine. It looks exactly like the um, By Terry Ombre Black Stars. And I've got a few from Laura Mercier, I've got a few from By Terry. By Terry are by far the most superior and they stay on so much, they're really, really good. I tried this on my hand earlier and I've washed my hand and it's still staying. So it's a really, really good base for eyeshadow. This one is Cypress Bronze. I think I'm gonna get all the other colors because it is just as good as the Ombre Black Star in Bronze something. Oh, Rupert, what's up, darling? Do you need a wee wee? I'll let you out in a minute, sweetheart, I promise. So I think these are definitely cheaper than the By Terry ones. So if you're looking for a dupe, I might see if I can show the two colours. It is a bit of a different colour, but it is good. So I'm going to try the other colours. The other thing I bought was the Body Shop Roots of Strength Firming Shaping Cream. So this is a moisturiser. I think it's a day cream. What's it say on it? Facial cream for firmer looking skin. Apply it all over face morning and evening. So it comes in this packet here and it comes in this little pot. It's really difficult to use pots when you've got a um, when you've got nails, so I might have to use a little spatula, but let's have a look what it looks like. Let's have a look what it smells like. I love a good smelling cream. Oh, oh, it's everywhere. <laughs> Oh, it smells really nice. It's got a really nice smell. I'm actually going to look for a serum. Um, oh, that feels really, really good. Um, I'm going to look for a serum because I'm just running out of mine. I did say this morning. So um, I won't need to use this for a little while. So I won't really give you an update yet. And the other thing I bought was the Drops of Youth Youth Liquid Peel. I've heard really, really good things about this. Um, so I'm going to give this a go. So it's not a peel, it's not an exfoliating thing with bits in, it's like an exfoliating, exfoliating peel. I'm going to give it a go. I've seen really good things about the vitamin C ones, but I really wanted to try this one. So I bought that as well. I can't tell you the prices, I literally can't remember. Oh, and the final thing I bought was a huge tub, this massive tub of the Japanese Camellia Cream. This smells divine and... I get terrible, terrible eczema on my wrist in the winter. And this cream has been a godsend. Everything I've used up till now has been, although this is perfumed, it's like not perfumed that it irritates my skin. Um, it's really good. Now I do like their body creams, but this is the best by far. Very, very thick. Let me show you. Like, it's like 
a moussey, bouncy texture. It reminds me of whipped cream. That's what it reminds me of. And it's just a lovely texture. I defy anybody who has bad skin to tell me this isn't good. I actually got this for £15. I do remember that. It's not normally that price, but I was able to get a really good discount um, on the lead up to Christmas. So this I did get for 15 but I think she can sometimes get it for about 17 50 So keep an eye out on any offers and she'll put all of those on her Facebook group as well. Okay, so the other thing that I... Um, I just realised some, some little bits missing, but I'll talk to her about that another day. Um, so I got, I won this lip juicer in raspberry, ginger and beetroot. And it's like a tinted lip balm. Smells amazing. Smells incredible, actually. Um, and then I also won um a goodie bag and then i also had another goodie bag so i don't know which was which but i've basically got a vitamin e quench sheet mask really excited to try that because i love a sheet mask and the moisture protect lip care which i'm going to give to claire because i want to see what she thinks of this i've got so many lip balms going on at the moment so i'm going to give that to claire and see what her thoughts are um, then i also got the british rose body yogurt this is a really good light cream it's almost like almost gel like oh that smells so good that actually smells really good i love rose scented stuff mm, i'm gonna have to think about that one because i don't know when i'm going to use it because it's usually quite irritating on the skin for me so um i'll give it a go see if it irritates if it doesn't then that'll be a good after shower one the one that i'm really intrigued about is the british rose Pot petal soft gel toner it's got like rose petals in it. It just looks murky there, but I wonder if I can get it so you can see the rose petals. Can you see? Oh my God, I'm so excited about this. I'm very excited about this one. Um, I haven't got a good toner at the minute, so. There's real rose petals and essence of hand-picked roses from Britain. That's quite specific. Oh, it's nice. It's not too scented though. And then the final little bits I got was the Fuji Green Tea Soap. And I'm going to give this to my mother-in-law in her little um, Christmas Day box that we're giving to everybody. She uses soap. And, oh, this, the new Juicy Pear Shower Gel. This smells so good. Oh, my God, it smells amazing. This is my favourite out of the new Christmas scent. So... That is gorgeous. I'll be using that in the shower. And finally, a little Moringa bath bubble. Bath bubble? It's probably like a bath bomb, isn't it? Um, and I'm actually going to give this to my niece because she loves anything that fizzes. So I'm going to put that in her Christmas Day box. So that is going to go in there. So all in all, I've got just got loads. My favourite thing by far in terms of how much it impressed me is this um eye crayon eye color stick i really 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 think this is great for the money cypress bronze that's the color i chose it's one of them one and done things but also it stays on so good right so that's that that's that little haul so i'm going to go and let roots out because he's busting for a wee um and put all this stuff away because there's just so much of it so i will catch up with you soon and i've really got to get that video done see you in a bit just inspecting the fridge and we spent over a hundred pounds on shopping but not food <laughs> bought loads of booze for presents and stuff um so yeah there isn't actually any food that we bought which is terrible so i think i'm gonna rummage the freezer and see what we've got okay it looks like it's gonna be the chicago town pizzas I like the pepperoni ones, Claire likes the four cheese, they take the same amount of time, they fit on one tray, and personally, I'm not a huge fan of pizza, but these are my favourite, and I think it's because they're really saucy, Not even though it looks like they're really cheesy, they're not as cheesy as that, and I prefer saucy, like, deep pan ones, so I'm going to enjoy my pizza. Don't even know if I'll have any salads with it or not. I might just have pizza. We'll see. 
It's advent calendar time and what day is it? 17. Where are you? Oh, it's a little door. It's a little door. And um, we've got, I will take two guesses. It's a Merry Christmas one. Two guesses. Second guess, Merry Christmas. And I was right. We have Merry Christmas again. I'm going to put it over there so we can have it for afters. That is for Christmas Day sharing. I told Claire we're not allowed to open it. I bet you we will. <laughs> that's it, that's today's advent calendar. Right, I'm home and um, it's day 18 of Vlogmas. I don't even know if I vlogged this morning. I definitely did an outfit of the day on Instagram. Anyway, I thought I'd come home and I'd just quickly show you my makeup because I did my makeup this morning. And Claire was like, why have you done your makeup so fancy? It's because I watched an Instagram video and I was like, I've got so much makeup. I've just, I just don't use it anymore. I don't do YouTube makeup videos anymore. So I thought, oh, I'll have a play. It's Christmas. So still on, um, I used, oh my God, this is so hard to do. I used this palette. So it's the Nubian 2. <laughs> you can see our excitable Edgar there. Hold on. The, oh, I'm not doing very well with this. How do I do it? There we go. The Nubian 2 palette. Um, and I did a halo eye. And it's still on. Uh, all day I've had it on. And that's what it looks like. I used the shade. Let me just read them. Jezebel Morocco, Layla and Zuri. So Jezebel is the sort of purpley reddish one to... Uh, the right hand side, um, I don't know if you see it right hand side actually, left hand side you might see it. And then Morocco, that orangey one, you can read them. And then that lovely bright one. So I use that on my eyes today and it has not budged. The other thing that I'm loving today is the um, eyeliner. It went really well. And finally the mascara, it's the first time I tried this mascara. So I used for the first ever time, I wonder if it's here or if I've... I can't remember where I've put it now. Um, it's the Superhero Mascara by Is It Cosmetics. And I've just ordered some. So I think it's great. Look at it. And that stayed on. It hasn't flaked at all. I'm ready to take my makeup off though. It has been all day. So I've still got a little bit of foundation on. And the reason it stayed on all day is because uh, firstly I use, I'm putting you right close to my face. Firstly I use this primer, which is the Arc Skincare um skin essentials one it's an spf 30 primer much prefer having an spf in my primer than in anything else like in my skincare so this is like a, a an spf it smells like looks like one but it's a primer and it works really well and then i also used afterwards and look i've used so much of it already this is the body shop makeup setting spray and it's great it lasts ages it lasts absolutely ages i really 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 recommend this so You'll love it. I wish there was more. It's only 60 mil. Just a 60 mil bottle. Anyway, I'm going to go. I think what I might do is end the vlog here because I do have to get this a long one anyway from yesterday. So I might as well just end the vlog and then I'm going to upload for tomorrow morning. Um, you will have seen a video go up today that isn't Vlogmas. It's my Wear It Wednesday because, oh, it's flickering again. It's doing that thing again. Um, it's a wear it Wednesday because I did do a try on haul. I've got another one to do this weekend, but I must do it this weekend. In fact, I might do it Saturday night, get it filmed because, um, oh, sorry, because it, that's weird, I can't see anything. That's better. I might get it done on Saturday because I need to send this stuff back for starters. I've had it for ages. Uh, if it doesn't fit, and also I'd like to get it up before Christmas. So that is the plan. Right. I'll end the vlog here and I will see you in the next one. Bye guys.